Hey guys, so I just finished filming a little um, video for my beauty channel. Um, yeah, my hair is a disaster. Yes, and I filmed like this. So this is what it looks like. It's a skater style dress. And yes, I gotta lose a few pounds. <laughs> oh my gosh. Seriously, but I really do, because I wanna fit this and fit it nicely. <laughs> that was so funny. <laughs> my hubby just called me downstairs. I feel like I'm filming in this room the whole day. I'm, I apologize, guys. But my hubby just called me downstairs to ask me uh, if I saw this thing. It's called the penis snake. And because my kids love animals, they like they were like researching um, these animals. And my little daughter, she's six years old, she's like, Daddy, look at this. It's, it's the penis snake. You guys should check it out. It's actually really funny. If I can find a clip to put it in here, I will because... It legit looks like a penis. It's just, you guys should see this dog just got discovered chewing an eraser and whenever he does anything bad, he immediately runs into his crate to hide out. Excuse me. Hello, you think your, your timeout's done? Is it? He just goes in on his own and apparently leaves on his own. Delicious. Tastes like you're mm. eating Watch this, guys. Bread. Tastes like you're eating pure sugar. Just watch this. Eating Put out, but you guys I don't know this way to anywhere. You guys need to put those in the timetables folders. Mm -hmm. Yo, yo. Uh oh. Oh, oh. Ah! Yo. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. So why take you so long? Yeah, ready. Come on. Come on. <laughs> and where you come from? Jamaica? Oh, what? Yeah. <laughs> 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 come straight from yard. <laughs> I thought you guys would recognize the fact that I come from Jamaica. Isn't it obvious? You know what? It could be. Why not? White people there, Jamaica. Oh, uh, should I translate for you all? To translate, I'd let you guys know that obviously there. I mean, I shouldn't even have to say it, but there are white Jamaicans, right? Y'all have seen them before. Oh my gosh, this is like a perfect situation to see the back of my nappy hair. Oh my gosh. Hi, this one. Hi, this one. Ready? Then I guess I'm gonna go to two of these. Hey, nappy, but I'm happy. Pocket full of no from the zoo. Yo, prison, yo, yo. When would it arrive? Then? Uh huh. Cause y'all wanna watch TV on the road. Here's Aaron finally reinstalling our uh, DVD player. We have two of them. One goes there, and one goes here. But since getting our new vehicle, since replacing our vehicle, when? Was it last August? I need yeah, to since replacing our vehicle last August, we haven't reinstalled them back in the car. And did we go on a long trip since then? No. No? No, we haven't gone. Oh, trip. I guess we haven't been on a long trip yeah, I'll since then. That's okay. Yeah, just so, here's Bunky. Look what I That's what I call her. Yeah. I look all fluorescent. I look so weird right now because the sun is just all up in my business. Here I am. Hi. <laughs> yeah. This one. Look at this guy all bundled up with his scarf. It ain't that cold. It's spring. It's not that cold. Oh, and he's Canadian. And he's Canadian. I'm cold. You gonna hold it? Check it out. So I'm rocking my natural hair for day two, and yes, it looks good. I always have this issue with like doing my edges. I don't know. I just keep forgetting and. I don't know, I'm not a big, I don't love greasiness in jail, so I'm not a big fan, but it would have looked cute had it been like perfected. Oh, what are you doing? Not much, I'm just putting these things on. Uh-huh, don't lose your popcorn ring in my head. <laughs> What's that ring on your pinky for? It's uh, for... Five years yeah. of service. <laughs> it's his engineering ring. I always call it this popcorn ring. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this one. Hurry up. Yep. Sorry, I'm just trying to. Daddy's not hurrying. No, he's Daddy not. Go faster. We want to leave. Here, <laughs> yeah, we come bring a movie. What Money can't buy you happiness. You gotta lock the door. Why are you oh my gosh, this so guy's leaving our house. So what I gotta do is I, I gotta get the cord. This guy's leaving our house unlocked. Oh yeah, that's why you put the DVD in again, Nicola. 
Why you gotta See? be so See me come rude? Up? Why you gotta be so rude? See me come? See me come? I will do no such <laughs> thing. <laughs> That's your duty to order the court. Remember? We, in fact, we need to go. Yeah, it's on the ground. Who has knuckles? So. Because all bound together, right? Okay, but who has Victor? Victor? Yeah. I don't have Victor. Can I see Vector? So, yeah, that's. We're the crocodiles. Our no, rap we're guys. Not, we're not, you can get SPO too. We're not we are endorsed by. by yep, what is it called? Audio? Oh, Audible. Oh. <laughs> we're not endorsed by Audible, but we do listen to the audio books. I know, right? And and then the funny thing is, those who are endorsed by Audible okay, don't even read. I'm just saying. Yeah, we can't say that. <laughs> I'm just saying. A lot of them can don't read. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm John not gonna front. Who are those people? They look uh, kind of interesting. Hmm. Did you press group? I didn't take. I didn't take a Tylenol. Yeah, he returns to work tomorrow. No, 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 Monday. Monday. Oh yeah, Monday. Same difference. Arr, but it's a short work week, guys. On. Good Friday. Ah. Good Friday. Come on. Out. I actually like, pulled something in my side trying to do that. Good Friday. Look at that guy's carrying in his truck. Dude, that's what trucks are made for. Wow. That's They're gonna turn with it. In the truck. Calm down. Go play your own game. I would feel very. I don't think. I don't think. Even if it was my idea, she wouldn't go for that. Dude, don't even play like that. Okay. I'm just into security. They, right? I'm into security. We've done that time and time again, but we just not not obviously carrying a futon, but carrying large items. It's fine to carry them. Oh, I just saw a hawk land over there. Oh, I probably just caught a field mouse. Poor little mouse. You're so sad. <laughs> Poor little mouse, man. He didn't even have a chance. Everyone's got to eat, right? And they keep the mouse population in check. That's true, because I'm afraid of them things. I, I did you? I don't even think you saw the last vlog that I posted. I called it Musotopia. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, yeah. I didn't see it. Yeah, my fear of. Well, we caught that mouse once. I didn't even explain that. I don't. Yeah, I don't think I ever explained that. So I in our in our old house, we lived by this area which had. A little bit of a field kind of like our current place actually and one night I heard this sound and I jumped up out of bed I was like Aaron Aaron I hear something and Aaron's like were you sleeping no I was in the washroom I, I, oh yeah I he was in the washroom and I was in the bedroom and I was like Aaron I hear something and so I ran I ran to the bathroom door and I'm like Aaron and then I saw the thing run <laughs> Oh my gosh, oh my freaked. God, I freaked out. She freaked out. I jumped on top of the bed and I was on there until he caught that thing. You don't understand. Panic. Honestly, I didn't believe her for a second. Because I was like, really? I've, I've never seen a mouse in a house before. So. <laughs> I know, I'm serious, I haven't. Gotcha. But you weren't afraid, that's the thing. I was... Oh, it's just a little mouse. Why am I, oh my why gosh. Are you afraid? I don't know, I don't know. I, yes, you know what, I'm surprised that we caught it so fast. No, we you caught, caught it. We caught it in like, like honestly, like three minutes. Yeah, we caught it in like it three so minutes. Like, swear, it seemed to me like forever. Because I was like, am I going to have to sleep on top of here? I'm no, probably not... No, but I'm it probably not even gonna be able to sleep tonight. But I can see how small and fast that thing was. I'm I surprised we, we caught it that quickly. Yeah, so what he did was he cornered it with some books. books. And then I'm like, no, don't use the books. Don't use the books. We need those to read. <laughs> I was like panicking. Then he caught it in like this little that cylinder my thing. Brain. What were those cylinders used for? It's plastic. Oh, it's like a pasta cylinder, but it's plastic. Yeah. We never used it for it for a pasta in the first place, but it was, yeah. Interesting story, interesting event, and I don't ever want it to happen again. I feel bad for that thing. We let it out. We didn't kill it. No, we let it out, but it was winter outside. No, well, he's not supposed to harbor in our house. No, it's That's not for yet. sure. He was, a, it was very unusual because he had such a big head and such a small body. If we, you should post the picture of it in the vlog. Yeah, I'll see if he, if he can find it, I'll interject it into this video. But that was not a good. And then we also had another incident. And guys, mind you, where we lived was a very good area. It's nothing. It's not like we lived in no projects or anything like that. I don't know. The mel the animals just, I guess, gravitate to us because we're animal lovers. But we had an experience with a bat too. A bat came in through the vent once. 
twice. twice and this was no this was like far and few in between the time with the the incident with the mouse because we lived at that place for like four and a half years but that was another incident that scared the crap out of me i was so scared yeah you were scared i was so scared i love animals but i love domesticated animals i'm not into like wild animals that could be rabid and i remember that you woke up in the middle of the night and you were like Aaron. I hear something. I hear something. I think something is in here. Yes. And I was so I was so groggy and I'm like. Oh. And no, no. Then you woke like, up and, and you're like looking around. You're like. It's pitch black. You're like, no, I don't hear anything. That's the, that's always your first reaction. It's always like I'm just crazy. I made it up. Well, I say that because I want I want to go back to sleep. Well, you, I should have just made your ass go back to sleep. And you know what? And then I don't know. If I wasn't so scared, I would have just gone to another room and just. Allow the bat to come and well, suck was... your blood. Oh my gosh, thank God it didn't bite any of us. <laughs> it didn't bite any of us. And if it did, oh my gosh. So the next morning, after Aaron caught it and released it, like you're good at catching animals. You should go into like pest control. Yeah. Side note. Yeah, it's pretty good at catching those things. So. Yes. No, when we woke up the next morning, we called. We, we all we caught all these things humanely. Because we were all catch and release. And we released it. Be, can you turn that down, please? I've asked that you would be once. Unfortunate. Before. Thank you. Yeah, that would be unfortunate. Am I the only one who can't stand those background noises when their kids are playing DS's? Like those noises, those sounds are so irritating. It's not <laughs> it's not interesting to hear on a on a regular for me. Ha. I can beat Gabrielle with any character. It doesn't matter. Ha. Are you guys playing okay, together? Stop being, being a show off. off. I'm not a show off. Are you guys playing are you guys playing with each other? Yep. Charlotte play with you guys too? Yeah. Anyways, back to what I was saying. Um, yeah, Aaron caught that rabbit, that rabbit. <laughs> Aaron caught that bat and released it. And we had to inquire about um whether like how you treat how you handle these kind of animals, like what we should have done, whether we should release it out. And Ted we we learned that we weren't supposed to. We we're supposed to catch it, capture it, and then keep it for um for testing. For testing. So, so they could be tested to see if they had rabies or anything. So yeah, because we were worried and we inquired about because none of us it was in our sleep, so we didn't know if any of us got bitten. We didn't think we got bitten, but you, know, you never know. And you couldn't, yeah. And I inquired guys, about like ra rabies shots so because <clears throat> I was concerned that any of us maybe got bit. And as a precautionary measure, they were saying that we should get rabies shots. <laughs> yeah. And the rape shots were were extreme. I, I, I feel so sorry for anyone who has to go through that process because um, we, we opted out and we said no. Yeah, kinda, we, well, we didn't see, crazy. no one got bitten. No one got bitten. So, we would have known by now. Right? Uh, yeah. It was, like, it was like eight years ago. Well, but, no, but I'm saying no one got bitten at the moment. You would have seen it. It has like it, yeah. a bat has two teeth. Yeah, like, we, would have, we would have probably known if it got bitten. Yeah, yeah. but then the, the rabies shot consisted of like three shots or something like that. In a day. Huh? Yeah, in one day. Three in one day? Three. There's like three in one day in the and, stomach, and then a week later it's another three. So and then another week right later it's another three. Yeah, and it was. Then, I think you do that for four weeks, and then you have to get another uh, every every couple months. That sounds so it was like, it, gruesome. It, it, it added up to like something like 20 needles or something. And in your stomach. I Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Guys, I, I don't have a needle phobia. Because when I was pregnant with my three kids, I had to, to get, um, I had gestational diabetes. If you guys haven't seen that pregnancy video. And I had to go and get um, blood drawn regularly. Like every single week throughout my pregnancy and then I also because of diabetes I ended up having to give myself insulin four times a day and so I was used to that but there are some moments when I legit held the skin <laughs> held my skin my thigh and cried because I didn't want to poke it through because it hurt so I'm not this I don't exactly have a phobia but I can't even imagine injecting myself in the stomach and I know some people do I think my mom does she's diabetic so I think that's where she injects hers but from what I've seen, it's not something I ever want to do. Yeah. Doesn't look like fun at all. It's better probably to get an insulin pump. Oh, really? Yeah, if your health insurance covers it, you can get an insulin pump. Oh. Right, and then um, it it's like self-monitoring. Oh yeah. It's like a yeah. closed. It's like a closed loop control. It yeah. Just, it gets a feedback from your body, and then it. it delivers insulin 
as necessary. Mm. But that gets implanted in you? Yeah, yeah, it's yeah, a surgery. Yeah. Let's get it. Oh. Yeah. yeah, it's pretty amazing. I pray that I don't ever get full-blown diabetes. Diabetes does run in my family on both sides. My mom is full-blown diabetic, and my grandmother on my father's side was diabetic. And I did have gestational diabetes with all three of my pregnancies. I was very scared that I would have it, but as far as I know of, I don't have it right now. And I hope it stays away for as long as it can because I don't plan on having any more kids. That's out of the way, right? So the rest is a matter of just yeah. maintaining my health and trying to eat That's well. Right. That's right. Yeah. Eating well. It's like 70% of it. It is, right? I mean, their yeah. genetics definitely <laughs> play a huge that. role. But in terms of, like, <laughs> getting your, uh, <laughs> your, uh, your body weight, yeah. it's, it mostly, mostly it's how you eat rather than... That's it. I was listening to that, that station about how a lot of um, food corporations, yeah, um, they promote exercise as a way of... As a way of uh, burning off the, 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 <laughs> the calories and the sugars. Yeah. Right? <clears throat> but, but studies show that, hey, it's very difficult to do, right? You don't want to work out for like half an hour to drink a pop. I know, I eh? It's, a, it's right? crazy. So, so really, it's, it's to, control your, to control your weight, it's like 70% of it is, your, uh, is what you eat, and then 30% is like your exercise. Mmm. Wow. It's very misleading. Well, yeah. yeah that's, it's, I don't know. It, when I look and tally up like the simplest of I things that I'd, I'd be putting in my mouth and think about no, how much it would cost, to, I put the how much energy I would have to expel yeah. to burn it off, it, it's like oh, ridiculous. Nice. Even like a, a thing of fries. The at the yeah, it's a lot. It's like, but yeah. I remember for like a muffin once, it was like you'd have to work out, you'd have to work out for like an hour to burn this one muffin. Like really? That's not, and then by the time I eat my next thing, I'm already like at accumulating. That's how fat builds, because then you end up accumulating and accumulating because you can't really, if you're eating the wrong things, you can't really ever burn off the energy unless you are some like marathon runner, daily jogger. Uh, what do you call it weight trainer or something where you're burning like mad energy every day it's not gonna happen that's how you slowly just put on weight no sucks it's unfortunate <laughs> you need to uh, yeah go to the potty anyways this is Charlotte this is what she found upstairs because um, the hubby and I were currently we trying to drawers mm -hmm. and Finding things to donate. They're called spring cleaning. You can go to the washroom. I would not want you to wee yourself. You never know. Anyways, um, yeah, we're upstairs. I'm actually supposed to be helping my hubby right now, but I'm down here on the computer uh, quickly uploading a video because I was having difficulties with iMovie all day long. So um, I am down here. We're going through things to just try to get rid of some of the stuff because the kids are not, I don't know, they've, they're have they running out of closet space and we just need to get rid of some of the stuff. And it's actually surprising because we're looking through them and there are a ton of things that actually don't fit, though I thought they did. So, so this is where we're at still with the room. <laughs> laundry. Piles and piles of laundry. And this guy's been really handy all day. Right? Yep. Once again, I have a Werther's original. <laughs> I could be like advertising for these people, seriously, because I have one of them in my mouth like every five seconds. Mm -hmm. But this is like, this stuff is unreal. Clothes everywhere. Mm -hmm. And I mean, there's still half of them in the laundry, so <laughs> where are they all supposed to go? I gotta go down and throw the load in the laundry and start the dryer again. He's taking my place. Until tomorrow, because when the work week resumes, which is Monday, y'all know who's going to be doing everything. Mm -hmm. okay, especially when the kids have activities from Monday to Thursday. Bye. They're going to say bye to the vlog? Bye. What do you want to tell them? And don't forget to... Subscribe. Yeah? Yes.
<laughs> Have a good night. No. <laughs> Have a good night, everybody. <laughs> good night, everyone. Oh my gosh. <laughs> good night, everyone. Good night, everybody. Um, I hope you all had a good day and hope you enjoyed our vlogs. And um, yeah, don't forget to uh... vote, rate, and subscribe or something. <laughs> <laughs> vote. Yeah. I don't know. What do you guys? What do you guys always say? Comment. Comment. Rate. And subscribe. And subscribe. There you see. I got it. The second try. Bye. Bye. Oh, Good thing. <laughs> we just ate supper and. Mommy, I don't want to go in the jungle. I don't want to go camping because I'll have to wrap myself in the water. <laughs> That's right. Oh. You try to get it nice smooth. Oh, no. Can someone flick the light on for me? Excuse me. Oh, wait, the, wait. The enemies wait, are trying. I want to go camping because I don't want to go shopping for like going with the rock. Rock the only good going. thing about camping is you get to see lots of wild animals. You can go fishing and you can go swimming. Thing, but what are you, you doing? Excuse. Goodbye. No, I did not. I don't care. Ben, you know um, the rules. What should you say? Uh, I'm carrying my food. <laughs> okay. Did you eat all your food? Oh, wait. Yeah, check out the ghetto garbage bag. Not that it's needed there. Why did we put that there again? It's filled with recycling? Which one? The one hanging over there. Yeah. And why are you sitting with your arms crossed like you mad at the world or something? Because I'm mad at the world or something. <laughs> Bye. Thanks. Bye. Are you Thanks. Ready? Bye. Thanks. Have a